So with Microsoft Excel, malfunctions happen. People, they experiment and they make mistakes. So in this case, what if one day and you wake up your Microsoft um, Excel spreadsheet now, it's, instead of having column uh, letters here, it now has a column numbers and it has row numbers. And when you try to click on the cell to find the reference of where uh, the formula is referring to, as you can see now here, is RC, M, RC, and RC, and RC. This is called the RC, R1C1 uh, format for functions. So it uses numbers only, meaning that there are no letters which can be used to, re to reference to cells. And this, uh, this is optional in Microsoft Excel. So in case someone makes a mistake or you want to make it complicated or to leave it in a way that people will not understand how you have formulated your formulas, you can use the R1C1 uh, feature that comes with Microsoft Excel. So here for us to be able to disable or to enable it, uh, we come into file, then we go to uh, options here. And then under options, we come here where it says formulas. So under formulas, we go to calculations, then working with formulas. So under working with formulas, we look at the first uh, option, which is this one here, the RC1 uh, reference style, which says change the way Excel formulas refers to cell. Instead of using letters for columns and numbers for rows, this option enables using numbers for both rows and columns. Cells are then referred to in the format R1C1. So once we click on this one here, we have to say body here and click OK. Now uh, we have uh, the default uh, Microsoft Excel look that we know. Where we have our columns uh, labeled in letters and then here we have uh, our number rows. And when we click it, we can see now that this is a C3 and this is a C3 divided with the percentages and all that. That you can easily follow. So in case you have uh, the R1C1 enabled, this is how you enable or disable it. So let's say thank you for watching and see you in the next video. So bye for now and ciao.